WFNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this Wednesday, day before the last day of uh, February. We're looking at the Dow down 184 at 38,790. Remember, we spoke about this Chapman Wave inside track repellent zone. We're looking at now the support zone comes in at about 38,680 uh, ish. And what I said to subscribers is we had a Chapman Wave uh, Roman candle yesterday. That means if we were to go uh, for 90 minutes below, and I think I said 38,860, something like that. Uh, be careful because we could test the low of yesterday. We've already done that and gone below it. So we're looking at that. We're looking at the S&P also in the Chapman Wave uh, inside track repellent zone, only down 15 at uh, 5,062 days young. We'll see where we close today. Still got Fed speed, got a bunch of stuff to go. Not even 35 minutes into the trading day. Let's look at the QQQ. QQQ is trading down. Uh, let's go. Uh, down three at 434.40. Um, this is a little different, so we're going to be watching this one because uh, the technicals are starting to deteriorate, but the nine is still over the 14. We've got the IWM, which was really a leader uh, before, is trying to come back. It's uh, down 92 cents at 203.10. Watching this very closely, we want to see some kind of rotation here for the semiconductors. And look, they also went to the Chapman Wave inside track repellent zone, pulling back uh, here. We're looking at the uh, gold. Let's see if gold's rallying at all. No, it's down three in the dollar. Let's see if that's rallying. The dollar is up a little. Yep, it's up 20 ticks at 104.01, just above the 50-period uh, uh, moving average. Oh, no, above the, oh, that's the red, nine-period moving average. That's very interesting. All right, let's get to uh, the bonds. Bonds are uh, up for 30 seconds. The yields are still in the upper register. Let's go to the... Um, Crude oil, crude oil is up seven, uh, up sixty cents, seventy nine forty. I'm really liking the way crude is oil, crude oil is acting, just in terms of crude oil, not the fact that it's a sort of an inflationary aspect, but it's acting very well. So I'll be back. Have I left out? No, I haven't left out anything. We'll be back in a moment to discuss this in much greater detail. This is an important phase in the market, just on the very short term, because that's going to give us clues as to March's potential. I'll be right back. Check out my opening call daily newsletter as well. See you in a few minutes.